But when she goes missing, could he be to blame? He was you see me, Grandma? Huh? I knew it was something really wrong. You ain't see me right there. That was you. Yeah, we gotta watch this. It's a real crime scene. We just reenacted. Grandma, you about to do all this talking while the show on now. Just over here talking. Oh, Tommy. Yeah, I hope they captured me good. What part did you play? The neighbor. Look at, look at her. Investigators reached out to <laughs> to see if they had seen anything. I thought you looked so fat. One woman tells police she was friendly with Sharonda, and the young mother was well liked among the other residents at the apartment complex. She got along with everybody. I know you ain't calling me fat, Grandma. But Sharonda's neighbor also says she noticed something unusual on Friday afternoon. The day Look at Sharonda Judah. disappeared. I was coming home from the store earlier, and I saw her outside talking to somebody. According to the neighbor, uh, the two appeared to be in a heated exchange, some type of argument. Look at Judah. Really going at it, and I can tell she was pretty upset. To police, it looks like this person could be Sharonda's killer. Away from me. Got their commercial. Sharonda Clark's neighbors. There I go again. Since the detectives have learned that the mother of two was spotted arguing. You better, you better act, Audrey. You better watch them arguing. Did you know what they were arguing about? No, they were too far away, but it looked pretty heated. She didn't know the cause of the argument, but she was worried about Sharonda, and so later on that night, she gave her a call. She called about. 5.30 p.m. The phone rang and rang, and then somebody finally answered, but it wasn't Sharonda. Oh, it's a man. The neighbor believes it was the same man who was arguing with Sharonda that day. Hi, may I please speak to Sharonda? Yeah, Sharonda's not here right now. Oh. He was telling her that Sharonda was not there, but she could hear Sharonda in the background and then he ended up hanging up on her. And that was probably the last time anybody heard Sharonda alive. They better put me in a scene again. Help them identify Sharonda's mysterious male companion. Investigators asked the neighbor if she could recognize him, if she knew what. Grandma, you see me. Yeah, sorry. So I said, I'm <laughs> I saw them from pretty far away, so I really couldn't get a very good look at him. All that she could recall was that he was a black man in his 20s. Pretty free time, man. <laughs> Did y'all see me? <laughs> was I acting? <laughs> was I serious enough? <laughs> y'all, that was like my first speaking role on the national television. I booked that myself. I am so proud of me. Her, me, she. Amen. Praise God.